Hi everyone, I'm Steve Campbell and you're watching The Ascent. In this episode, I hit a milestone. What's up everybody? This is episode 16 of The Ascent. I'm your host Steve Campbell. I am here just outdoors in lovely Denver, Colorado. Back here in lovely New York City. I'm here in my lovely apartment. I'm in Las Vegas. I am here at uh, Melissa's sister Allie's house. I'm in the Rockies. I'm just back here in cloudy slash rainy Colorado. I'm just hanging out indoors today because it is freezing outside here in Denver. It's way too sunny to take my sunglasses off. I'm just outside enjoying this f beautiful fall weather out here in Denver. In this episode, I'm teaching you how to start a business. We're talking networking. We're learning about Ascension Day. We're talking side hustles. I'm helping you find a job. I'm making moves. I'm living in Denver. Didn't think I would make it to 10 episodes. I, I mean, I really did, but this officially feels like a real show to me now. My thesis continues to be bringing people value, and so that's what I'm trying to do with these videos and with this content and with this vlog. The Ascent is all about documenting the journey. It's creating the blueprint for people, a community of documenters and people documenting their journeys. The goal of what I'm trying to do and leave my impact on the world is try to get more people to start pursuing their dreams. I think everybody should be telling their story to the world, and I think that they should be doing it on these platforms because that's where everyone's spending their time. I want people to start pursuing their dreams, start doing their own thing, and I'm willing to help anybody who doesn't know how to start or does, has no clue on how to get there. I'm in it to work with the individuals out there, the people that are like me five, six years ago when I wanted to start a business, but I had no idea how. I always had big aspirations. I always had big dreams. I always wanted to own my own business. Our overall goal is leaving the world better off than we found it. And that's what I'm trying to get people to do is just to start. If you just chip away at it a little bit here and there every day, you'll be surprised at the results that you see. Put in work in different places and then double down in those areas that it, it's really working out for you. That's what I love about this. It really is documenting the process. You can plan all you want, but at the end of the day, if you're just planning, you're not actually doing it. The more I've been doing this, the more I realize that the pie is big enough for everybody. It's okay to not know what you want to be when you grow up. The benefits really reflect the work ethic you're putting in. You never know like where you can build an audience that you know previously didn't even exist. I think once you realize how much you love the things that you're doing, that you'll start to do it more often. And I would hope that eventually it'll become like a full-time thing. I'm gonna learn things on the fly and you're gonna learn with me. And that's the beauty of this thing and documenting the whole process. Set some goals for yourself in the next year and actually attack them. I wanna become a better storyteller in 2017. travel the world.
something. I'm challenging myself to do more things that scare me. coming into focus. You don't get better unless you do something, right? Everybody wants to get from point A to point B, and point B is usually a lot higher than where point A was, and everybody sort of defines success on their own terms. There's never gonna be a better time. I mean, hey, what do you got to lose, right? You're always gonna have that little fear inside of you just for doing that, a fear of failure, but if you just go for it and you just do something, good things will happen to you. Between you and me, life is all about the stories you can tell. So my advice to you, start at the moon and work your way backwards. You can figure out how to get anywhere if you just figure out where the finish line is and then reverse engineer how to get there. If anybody who looks like you has made it, you can too. Put people at the center of whatever you're doing. Be scrappy, that's what it's all about, right? Now you just gotta be willing to do any and everything that's in your wheelhouse or in your means. So put in effort, put in the work, create something, go out there, start your podcast, start your vlog, climb that mountain, go hiking, do the things that you say you're gonna do. It all comes down to how you value your time. Your circumstances don't change unless you do something about it. So yeah, there's not much more to it than that. So time to get to work. I'm learning a lot. I hope you guys will learn a lot with me. First and foremost, I wanted to thank anyone who's ever contributed anything to The Ascent at all. Thank you very much for your time and attention. I appreciate you. I'm really grateful for everything that's happened along the way. I really have so much to be thankful for, but really at the heart of it all is my family, friends, coworkers, and loved ones. I can't wait to bring you all along on this journey with me. Other than that, have a great day. And yeah, more videos to come. I'll see you soon. Thank you for being along for the ride. All right, baby, let's get after it.